I didn't mean to activate this. All right, uh, it's rolling now. So just a brief video here. I just want you to I want you to see that both of my neighbors' windows are open. I, I don't I want to um, take that. see like this uh, spiral effect uh, with the blinds there. But um, I just wanted to note I'm shooting this on QCIF uh, again, like 144 by. Uh, 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 I don't know, 177, the very lowest setting on um, open camera. It's a, a great, great little, uh, um, I guess, uh, open source uh, app that's out there. So I want you to see the numbers in, in the air. Well, again, uh, we're so close to each other that, uh, you know, if, you, if, if I had my windows open, you see, I, I keep the blinds uh, closed at all times and my windows closed at all times. I don't know if you could hear some sounds out there. Uh, it sounded like somebody's TV was on. Maybe they cut it when I started this recording. I'm not 100% sure. I knew I could walk over to this window at any time and start shooting some some video over here because this guy's window is open every every time, uh, every day, all, all day, every day, basically. Um, and uh, sometimes sometimes the window's up, sometimes it's down. I guess he. Uh, Instead of uh, opening the blinds to let in some light, he just lifts them uh, completely, 100%. But it, it, as I mentioned on a different video, you know, humans are still humans the way they were for thousands of years, or uh, you know, since the beginning of time. God, God knows how long uh, that was. And uh, I guess if you include the cavemen, they didn't have blinds. But uh, um, you may remember from the movie Top Gun, I think um, Tom Cruise or uh, the other characters uh, say things like, uh, if if you if you point your nose at somebody, meaning like the Russian MiGs or something that are flying through the sky, uh, sort of if if you do it twice or three times, or something like that, uh, you're asking to be shot down or something like that. And I I believe it's based on uh, real life, and I think I've seen real life footage uh, from uh, the Gulf Wars and stuff where they say uh, that kind of thing and, you know, somebody shot down and unfortunately the refrain after that, you know, for the uh, for the military men who are not yet veterans, but they, uh, you know, it's common to uh, respond, good kill, good kill. Um, you know, when you, you know, you feel like you shot the, the guy, you identify as the bad guy, which is the opposition. But anyway, so, uh, you know, another way to look at it is uh, they used to have the, uh, the, you know, especially this is especially with guys who are much more confrontational with their uh, testosterone, you know, in this kind of Mars and Venus world. W women don't do that. You know, for women to look at each other, it's kind of a friendly gesture for men to look at each other. And this is something, uh, I live in San Francisco here, but I don't have much contact with the gay community. Or uh, well, it could be more people who are gay than uh, than I realize. But um, they say women women can look at each other. I, I don't know if you know gay men's personalities are are uh, you know uh, kind of get, getting into a murky area. But with guys, uh, it's sort of a hostile challenge. It's sort of, you know with guys they'll say, "What are you looking at?" And the other one, will, you know, natural response will be, "What are you looking at? What are you looking at? What are you looking at? What are you looking at?" That kind of thing, and uh, as as you can hear, it, it kind of uh, you know it amps up very quickly, and and uh, you know, I hate to say it gets hostile very quickly. So they they put us in these awkward positions. You know, this is a ridiculous way to set up apartments. I guess it's not so easy to make the windows canted, so we're not looking right into each other's windows, right into each other's apartments. You know. Uh, this, this building was probably made a hundred years ago before uh, people could just photograph directly right across into somebody else's apartment. But um, it's it's awkward at best, and uh, you know uh, you know much worse at, at worst. Here's uh, some TV date and time check. This was the Olympics. Uh, Usain Bolt uh, uh, couldn't finish a race today. I think he pulled a hamstring or something. And I guess this is NASCAR or something like that. So it's. Uh, uh, Saturday, the 12th of August, uh, 2017, and it's, uh, I don't know if you can see it. It's, uh, almost 3 p.m., uh, 14.54, 2.54 p.m.